Max does really have those showers to the west falling apart as they enter the area on the over and I can't totally rule out another isolated shower or two. We had a couple of them around last night and even to a start off this morning. So there's a lower chance during the morning, better chance into the afternoon. If you do get wet, you have a better likelihood during the afternoon with the heating of the day. Some heavy rain in there, but not seeing any severe weather threat. They will be scattered showers and thunderstorms, so not lasting terribly long. Then we get into the evening hours. The overnight looks pretty quiet for the day on Friday. Friday as a whole actually looks pretty good. Not seeing anything more than a very stray shower, so plenty of sunshine in there. We get those temperatures back up into the upper 80s, close to 90 degrees. Right now, temperatures are a little bit cooler around some of those showers, even Hodgensville at 82 degrees, 86 in Glasgow, 86 in Bowling Green, even a shower maybe starting to pop up around BG 88 in Morgantown 84 over into Hartford 86 in the Franklin that dew point is certainly up and this is what we can expect. The trend is to stay a very muggy over the next several days. Now Friday 90 degrees then we're going to the weekend. A few more of those scattered showers and thunderstorms out there. Maybe better chances though as we get into the afternoon. So it could be a little bit on the active side. A spotty shower storm as we continue into the evening hours. Temperatures into the lower 70s and as we do look ahead to your Thursday here during the morning again can't totally rule out a shower on that early morning jog and then as we get into the afternoon of course we're sweating it out and sometimes it's nice to get a storm or even a shower around because it cools you down. Temperatures in general will be in the upper 80s, obviously without any rain, but we do have a few more of those showers out there Thursday afternoon. Friday looks dry, then we get into the weekend. We'll see some of those showers and even some thunderstorms highs only in the middle 80s. We're actually cooler than normal into next week and then by Tuesday and Wednesday, mainly dry overall highs close to 90.